Hello everyone and welcome back to AO.com's YouTube channel. Once again we're going to be attempting a ridiculous recipe in an unexpected appliance. Today, breakfast sandwiches with an iron? If you're familiar with life hacks and you might already know about grilled cheese sandwiches using an old iron, but grilled cheese sandwiches, grilled cheese sandwiches, whatever, <laughs> they're too easy. So we're going to make things a little bit more difficult and go with a breakfast sandwich. So you're going to want some bread, I've got some mushrooms, some tomatoes, some beans, some ham because I don't trust an iron to cook either sausages or bacon. I could have pre-cooked them but that's cheating. Bit of butter, salt and pepper and um, an egg. We're just going to crack an egg in there and see if it'll work. Let's crack a lap on then. Lie yourself out a cheeky little tea towel. Then on top of your tea towel, put yourself a little bit of baking parchment. One of them. Next thing you want to do is get your old bread. Don't know what your favourite is. White, brown, half and half. I'm gluten free because, you know, I'm that person. And now you just want to butter one side of each slice of bread. I don't want my sandwich to be too thick. So instead of using actual tomatoes, I'm going with a thin layer of tomato paste. Let's make our second layer of meat. Of meat. It's actually some smoked ham. Just so you know, you get that smoky, bacony flavour without the risk of food poisoning. So you just want one slice of ham. Two mushrooms, I think, will do it. Maybe not even that. But you want to cut them very thinly into thin mushroom slices because we do want the sandwich to cook all the way through. Bit of pepper, let's go with that. Beans is next, isn't it, really? Can't go wrong, gotta go with some beans. Adding a good tablespoon of beans onto the top of your bread, just spread them over the mushrooms. But what I want you to do is I want you to kind of create a well, okay? Because this little well is going to become home <laughs> to an egg. This leg well. Get another bit of ham. Or cheese. Cheese doesn't technically go in a breakfast sandwich. Do we care? No. Cut yourself some very thin slices of cheese. Now it's time to crack the egg. Oh dear. Very gently. Pop your egg inside your bean well. Stay. Oh no! No, 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 stay there. Stay in your bean well. Get the cheese and... and, and no. <laughs> stay. Right. Don't worry about this, team. Don't worry about this. All right. Some of it wants to stay in. <laughs> Use your eggshell because to just scoop some of it, the rest of it up. And put it over the top. I can't breathe. Use your <laughs> put the other bit of bread on top, butter side up. There you go. You know what? This is going to be like a cheese sandwich soaking in an omelette, but that was deliberate because I wanted any bread all along, didn't I? Turn your iron on to the highest temperature. Get another bit of baking parchment and just put it over the top and make a little baking parchment. Uh, package. Well, I just want you to put another tea towel on top and then with your iron that's really hot, just put it on top of it. <laughs> yeah, that should say three minutes. Just keep checking that your iron's not burning through your tea towel. Order has been restored and I've been ironing this little toasty for a while now and I think it's time to give it a flip. So let's do that. Flip! <laughs> Egg's still feeling soggy and not like cooked. It's gonna be a while, yeah? <laughs> more of a direct approach. I'm going to just rid of the tea towel and just iron the actual sandwich. It smells of fabric conditioner and cheese. There we go. That's more like it. Right, I'm done. Let's open this baby up. Ooh, ooh, bleh. <laughs> what are you? Can I get you off this? No. You have no idea how much I don't want to try this. Now your sandwich is cooked, get yourself a plate and be ready to turn it out, <laughs> if you can. Come on, sandwich. <laughs> okay. Mmm, yummy. Bet you can't wait to try that. This is the end result, team. Looking yummy. I'm just going to give this lovely sandwich a taste. Oh, yum. Thing is, you can't really go wrong with mushrooms, beans, tomato, and ham, and a bit of cheese. It's a good combination. The problem is here is that the bread is just completely incapable of being bread. <laughs> because I went with gluten-free bread, and I'm tempted to make a healthy food choice when I'm making a video about creating a sandwich with an iron. <laughs> My own healthy choices have backfired on me here because I honestly think, had I just had standard white bread, this might have worked. Uh, good effort needs work. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed that video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Let me know what you think in the comments below and we'll see you soon.